Here's a Moto G Power, the 2022 model. And you have an issue with your phone where you have a black screen. Even though you have a black screen, you know that the phone is on. Maybe you're getting phone calls, maybe you can feel it vibrate, maybe getting notifications in. Or another way to check if your phone is still on is just go ahead and plug it in. When you plug it in, you should feel it vibrate and hear that ding, okay? Now take note that this phone is actually fixed. The screen is working, but we're gonna pretend we have a black screen here. I'm gonna give you several easy, easy options that you can do right now at your home, nothing to do with taking the phone apart or anything, okay? So first thing is this. If you have a case on here, take the case off. Next thing is this. So with the power button, we're gonna go ahead and restart it using only the power button. So we're gonna press and hold that power button and do not let go until you see a Motorola logo appear, then let go, okay? So we're gonna do this together. Pretend my screen here is totally black. And here's the power button, ready, set, go. Press and hold, do not let go until we see a Motorola logo appear, okay? Pretend I have, I have no idea what's on my screen, it's just a black screen, I'm just holding onto that power button, waiting for a Motorola logo to appear. Come on, where is it at? Oh, Motorola logo. Go ahead and let go of the power button and let it boot up normally and hopefully you are now out of the black screen. If you still have a black screen, then we're gonna to go to option number two. Okay, so if you still have a black screen, no problem. So what we're gonna do next is this. Go ahead and grab your phone and you see the power button right here. What I want you to do is press in and out five times kind of hard, okay? One, two, three, four, five. And the reason why we're doing that is because it's possible that your power button is stuck or jammed or maybe there's lint or dirt in there. Maybe you got coffee or soda in there. Anyway, if there's issues with the power button, it can cause all kinds of issues as well as a black screen. You can get like boot loop issues and so on, okay? So from here, next thing is we're going to go ahead and plug it in. Plug it in. Wait five seconds, okay? After five seconds, now... Again, let's pretend my screen is black here and it's plugged in, it's charging, and we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna restart it using the power button, okay? Ready, set, go. Press and hold that power button. And do not let go until we see a Motorola logo. Pretend my screen here is black. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just holding onto the power button while it's charging, waiting for a Motorola logo to appear. Hey, there it is. Go ahead and let go. Let it boot up normally. And now ho hopefully you're out of the black screen. If you're still, still stuck in the black screen, then we're gonna go to option number three. All right, so you still have a black screen, no problem. So the next step we're gonna do here is we're gonna go ahead and unplug it. Now what we're gonna do next is what I call the tap method, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold the phone in your hand like this. We're gonna grab two fingers and we're gonna tap all over in the screen and all over in the back. The whole premise behind this is it's possible that you have a ribbon or a cable that's slightly disconnected and a little tap can pop it back into place, okay? So. Hold the phone in your hand like this. We're gonna pretend my screen is totally black here. Grab two fingers and what you wanna do is tap kind of hard, okay? All over. And sometimes as you're doing this, all of a sudden your screen may turn on. You may get half the screen. You may get like white lines. Just keep on tapping. But if the screen pops on automatically, then you're probably done, okay? Now also on the back of the phone, okay? You wanna tap kinda hard. You also wanna tap all around the camera lens too, okay? If you don't wanna get it dirty or smudge it up, just use a cloth on there. You kinda wanna tap all over. All over, just like that. Now turn the phone over and see if your screen is on. If it's still off from here, no problem. Remember, press and hold that power button. Do not let go until you see a Motorola logo appear then let go, okay? Now hopefully you are now out of the black screen. If not, we're gonna to go to the next possible fix. So you still have a black screen, no problem. What we're gonna do next is what I call the massage method. So what we're gonna do is, we're basically gonna hold the phone like this in our hand, we're gonna grab two thumbs and we're gonna press in, we're gonna massage, massage all over on the screen, as well as the back. This is the same premise as uh, the tapping of the, um, the, the tapping as well, okay? It's possible you have something slightly dislodged, so. We're going to go ahead. If you don't want to smudge up your screen, you can put a cloth on there or whatnot. So I just start off on the screen here, and I'm going to hold the back like this. And as I'm pressing here, I'm also pressing on the back, okay? So we want to give it a nice massage all over on the screen, okay? Press, press. Give it like a nice massage. Same thing here. Sometimes as you're massaging, the screen may pop on automatically, or you may hear a little click, okay? If you hear a click, then typically... 
um, after you hear that little click that uh, your screen will turn on okay anyway just keep on going the same thing on the back side here too okay grab both thumbs here press press you want to give it a nice massage all over press press around the camera lens you can put a cloth on here if you wish just press all around there give it a nice massage now turn the phone over tap on that power button and see if your screen is on if it's still off no problem remember press and hold that power button do not let go until you see the motorola logo appear then let go okay if you're still down no problem we're going to go to the next possible solution so this next solution i have for you is what i call the smack method what we're going to do is hold our hand out like this we're going to grab the phone and we're going to smack the screen and also on the back this is the same premise as the tapping and massage method okay so we'll start off smacking the screen you can put something on your hand if you don't want to smudge it up but we'll start off on the screen here and what we're going to do is smack it like that and then tap your power button to see if the screen is on if it's still black no problem we're going to do the back or the bottom of the screen now Get a couple whacks like that and the same thing on the back okay and the back bottom as well grab your phone tap on that power button and see if your screen is on now if it's not on no problem remember press and hold that power button do not let go until you see the Motorola logo appear then let go now if you still have a black screen the next um, possible fix I have for you is what I call the freezer method so, to, so what, what I want you to do is this with the phone bare bones naked like this I want you to put this in your freezer leave it in your freezer for 15 to 20 minutes after 15 to 20 minutes grab your nice cold phone out of the freezer tap on that power button and see if your screen is on now if it's still black no problem while the phone is nice and cold press and hold that power button and do not let go until you see a Motorola logo appear then let go okay now the thing is if you guys tried all of these steps and you still have a black screen then what I would recommend is trying every single step again try it two times three times try it at least up to seven times sometimes the seventh time is a charm if you tried every step at least seven times I'm gonna say at least 80% of you guys should now have a working screen okay so if this worked for you uh, give me a thumbs up and comment which method or combination of methods worked for you and if it didn't work for you give me a thumbs down all right good luck guys